Hey guys, it's me Amanda, and today we'll be cleaning my bedroom. I feel as if it's always a hot mess in my bedroom. It doesn't help that I don't make the bed every morning, but I find the excuse that I don't have any natural light in my bedroom that deters me from coming in here very often. Anyways, we're starting on Zach's side of the bed. His side is always a big mess because he doesn't feel the need to clean unless it's overwhelming, and even then, he still doesn't clean. I have a lot of craft stuff I need to put in the closet, but the closet is always cluttered with stuff as is. No, I do not clean the closet in this video. It is hard to sense there's only a magnetized battery light in the closet and not enough room to put a camera. But I will definitely get to the closet one of these days. This is Zach's chair, where I put majority of my clean clothes when I'm not using them if they're not in the drawers already. I don't do much of anything during the day but work on the computer, except for working out now, but I have a set of clothes for that, so any clothes I feel like I didn't get dirty throughout the day, I generally reuse before washing. The bookcase is where I put stuff at the end of the night, so this mess is on me. Much of the stuff I keep on the bookshelf, but is just all over the place. And the books are piling up on top of the bookcase as well. Here I am finally making the bed. You'd think I would have done this first, but I didn't. I really should be making the bed every morning, but oh well. As you can see, the floor is a mess. It is mostly covered in cat and dog fur, so it looks really good after a good vacuuming.
And that's the end of this video. Not very long for one of the messiest rooms in the house, but I also don't deep clean as nearly as much as I need to. I'll definitely get a video up of me deep cleaning every section as deeply as I can eventually. Hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe.